WRTV Streaming News is sponsored by Tom Wood Group. From Indy's Streaming News Leader, this is a WRTV update. A suspect has been detained following a deadly shooting on the city's east side. It happened near 21st and Emerson. Police say calls came in around 430 Saturday evening for a man shot. When they got to the home off Kildare Avenue, they found the victim. And stopping the violence is the goal of organizations across Indianapolis. Dozens of people came together to walk, hoping to raise awareness about gun violence. It was the seventh annual Far East Side Community Peace Walk, started by City County Councilor Lakeisha Jackson. People gathered at the Community Alliance of the Far East Side, brought posters and pictures, then they walked to Amber Woods Apartments. Ashlyn Walker came out in support of the walk's mission, holding pictures of her sister Chanel Walker Well, who was killed in 2008. I'm upset. I'm upset that it hasn't stopped. Um, like I said, my sister was killed in 2008. Um, and it's still going on. It's, it's even worse than it was then. Um, so it kind of pains me to know that um, this is an issue. This is a serious issue. Um, and we're just going to have to fight and all work together um, to, to get better gun laws, um, to get better mental health for our, our people out here. At the end of the walk, Pathway Resource Center held an outreach event. There have been at least 131 homicides in Indianapolis this year. John? Mostly clear skies for tonight. Temperatures dropping off in the low to mid 60s. A slight reduction in humidity initially. We'll start to see it come back as we head towards the afternoon. We'll see sunny skies to start the day on Sunday, but as we go through the day, especially towards the afternoon, we'll start to see, notice high thin cirrus clouds beginning to move in, eventually turning us overcast for the afternoon. Temperatures will be maybe a degree or two cooler than what they were on Saturday. So we're talking high temperatures mainly in the mid 80s, 85 in Indianapolis, 85 in Muncie, 86 in Columbus and 87 degrees for a high temperature in Bloomington. Now late Sunday evening, we may see an isolated shower. There'll be a slightly better chance for showers around here through the day on Monday. We'll keep clouds around. It'll also be a bit cooler on Monday with highs only in the 70s. But as we go through late afternoon, we'll start to watch for the chance for some scattered showers and thunderstorms storms to perhaps develop along a line and then move off to the east as we head in towards the evening. Tuesday looks like we'll have a cloudy day as well. 76 degrees with a widely scattered shower possible, but notice the temperatures below normal Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday, but then we start to warm things up for the end of the week and perhaps by next weekend we're talking highs near 90 degrees.